Welcome to Math in a Minute. My name is George Cantrell. Yes, quickly let's solve this question. Yes, it's based on multiplication of two binomials, which is currently the topic we are treating on. Solve math, okay? What's the question saying? Now, simplify into bracket x minus 1, bracket close, raised to the power 2. That is all raised to the power 2, meaning you are just multiplying x minus y twice. That is all good. So let's have our solution neatly written over there. Okay, good. Nicely placed. And let's multiply this twice. So we have x minus y. X minus y is multiplying itself twice. That is all. So we write it in this form. Good. Now let's apply the rules of algebra. Any term here is multiplying everything in the other bracket. So it's into bracket x minus y, bracket close, minus what? Y into bracket x minus y, bracket close. I believe you understand it. It's simply because in all that, there is a rule that each term in one bracket should multiply everything there in the other bracket. Okay, good. So let's continue. Now, x times x will give us with x squared rules of algebra. Now, x times negative y, it will give us negative xy. Yes, you arrange it alphabetically. That's why x come before the y. Don't write it as y x no right that's x y alphabetically right x come before y good so we are done here now negative y times x to give us negative x y good rules of algebra and anytime a negative multiplies a positive the answer is negative so please take note of this negative now negative y times negative y will give us positive y squared rules of algebra and take note anytime a negative multiplies a negative the answer becomes positive so let's continue to so equal to x Square. Let's check whether we have like terms. Yes, we have x, y, x, y. Yes, we can solve it together, right? Yes, and this x, y standing in low is the same as one in front. This x, y standing is the same as one in front. So please, I'm going to do something here. Pay critical attention here. I can write it as minus one x, y minus one x, y plus y squared. Why am I doing this? I'm doing this for you to understand it and appreciate the answer. Okay, so it's equal to now x squared. Now, negative 1 minus negative 1. These are like terms, x, y, x, y. So, negative 1, x, y, minus negative 1, x, y. It will give us negative what? 2, x, y. Simple rules of algebra. You are only one going O again. Okay, so plus y squared. Easy as A, B, C, D, right? This is your answer. So this brings us to the end of today's math in a minute. So we meet again. It's adios.